Most of us have a set idea on what a democrat looks like and believe that they belong to a certain demographic. You trying to say black? We brought together seven democrats. I am a democrat. I'm a democrat. I am a democrat. This is right up my f-ing wheelhouse too. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this right. I should be able to nail this as quickly as I nailed the fake Muslim one. I come from a conservative family. Yeah, Went to college and was like Where did you go to college? Oh, USC. Oh, Democratic oh, family over here. It's the white kid on the right corner, far right corner. I'm kidding. I don't know. I haven't seen enough yet, but it just does sound like a Republican. I think I was targeting Nick a little bit. USC is known for being a more private conservative school. The most important uh, issue for me is the environment. I think Trump pulling out of the Paris Agreement was horrible. I think the U.S. should lead this global initiative towards renewable energy. Oh, God damn it. Cry. I'm like trying to get it together right now. If the election was today, who would you vote for? Mm. Andrew Yang. I think it might be the black dude actually because he's got real he's got real like he's got real black concern i mean he's got drip so it's probably not him never mind he's not wearing khakis so it's probably not him he's not wearing like ugly ass f large ass parachute looking ass button-up shirt tucked neatly into his khaki pants that are pulled up all the way to his f nipples so it's probably not him but you're obsessed with superficial identity wow that was a great comeback, dude. We're watching literally a f***ing YouTube video about superficial identity, but okay, I'm glad that you're above it and you let us know in Twitch chat, brother. I'll say it. Why? I think his, like, the freedom dividend with $1,000 a month helps, like, the far majority of people in America. Like, I don't mean to interrupt, but also, I don't feel like Andrew Yang really um, emphasizes the points that you first brought up about healthcare, mm -hmm. and I think, like, Elizabeth Bernie Warren Bernie. and Bernie yeah. Sanders. But he yeah. is, he is yeah. for... Medicare for all, though. That's a Bernie, okay, bro. True, but like, I feel like other oh, politicians, correct. especially who have like, would be led more. the forefront. I'm planning to vote for Elizabeth for Warren. What are your views on abortion? Pro-choice, easy. Were you lying? <laughs> like, was inconsistent with what policies are really most. Important Sarah is to him. a Democrat. I think a really important question is what. Sarah is not only a Democrat but really a Bernie bro. A Democrat. I am Iranian American. Sorry, I didn't oh. get that. Iranian. <laughs> I'm Iranian American. Oh, okay, yeah. And Your parents are immigrants. Yeah, my parents are immigrants. When Sarah started asking questions, Sai kind kind of cut her off, and I don't know. That seemed kind of like a very aggressive way Hold to up. come at it. Women's rights are really. <laughs> Hold up, she's Iranian American. They're in Los Angeles. Iranian Americans in LA can go either way. Iranian Americans in LA, oh my lord. Some of them are so fucking conservative, dude. Holy shit, and so rich. But her takes on healthcare and, and defensive, subtle defense of Bernie Sanders is pretty good. Important to me, as well as like environmental rights. I'm a huge Bernie Sanders supporter. Um, what ways She's do you good. support the women's rights movement? Well, like abortion, Planned Parenthood. I'm half black, half Mexican, and my mom was actually brought here as a baby from my abuelita and abuelito from TJ, and then my dad's obviously black. And so, <laughs> kind of like the same thing as black people are Democrats. Yeah. I don't like people telling me what to do. <laughs> That's it. That's GG's. Should we, should we skip to the end? Should we just not watch the rest of it? Because we found her. This video is over. That's a bingo. We'll see. Percent pro -choice. It's definitely her, I though. Think was but I would say, like, I'm a baby Democrat because I grew up. I grew up Christian. My main thing is abortion, health care. Again, know, baby uh, Democrat. I, like, just, just got into it. So The big thing that made me a Democrat was knowing in high school that I was gay and I was raised in the military in the era of don't ask, Bro, don't he's, tell, I swear to God, he just gives me hella Republican energy, though. Nick gives me big-time USC gay annoying edgelord Republican vibes, dude. I'm going in between him and, and the black girl. Like, I'm just... Uh, yeah, I need to see. I need to see his shoes. I need to see his shoes to make a final decision. And, yeah. How old are you, real quick? Thirty. Oh dang! Oh, you're in your twenties. A on. lot of shame. And, yeah. I don't know. How old are you, real quick? Thirty. Oh dang! Oh, you're in your twenties. Yeah. How so. Like, you look so young. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Like everyone has a cover. Think, like everyone has a cover. Like either oh I'm a Democrat because I'm gay. Oh I'm a Democrat because I'm black. Oh I'm a Democrat because I'm I don't know, like, it's just not white, right? Everyone has a cover like that. It was harder to choose. Oh, I'm a Democrat because I'm a woman. It doesn't matter. We'll see. We all were just really open with each other. I can't believe they, she's 100% a Democrat. I mean, she. All the other women.
Okay, Loki, if she follows me, maybe she's not a Democrat anymore, but she is a Democratic Bernie Sanders supporter. In the box had very like concrete examples to back up why they were a feminist and why they were pro-choice. It really sucked that I had to like- Typical fucking libs, of course, executing the Bernie bro, saying that she's not a Democrat. Typical fucking libs, dude. Like vote Sarah out, but in my head, her answer was- a You're not a real Democrat. I'm gonna start off somewhere really weird, but it's just based off a study I read. If you guys were to see a severed hand floating in a glass bottle, how disgusted would you be? A severed hand in a glass severed bottle? Severed hand in a glass bottle. <laughs> Your face. How disgusted That's would you be? That's an intense question. I would... How disgusted would you be? You I would probably be pretty disgusted, I okay. would say. You love your I would probably throw devil. up. Blood really freaks me out. Okay. <laughs> is, is, is it bloody and stuff? Yeah. Because, like, that's a However your me. mind goes with it, how disgusted do you think? How disgusted I, I can't even imagine. It so, like, I'm not going to say super disgusting, but obviously wouldn't just have it on my mantle. My gut reaction isn't gross. It's more, like, Why? comical and confused. <laughs> like, yeah. I would like to know more information. <laughs> I'm curious. Okay. Wait, why? Wait, wait, why? Yeah, what's yeah. the what's deal? The, what's the study? Okay. Essentially, a study in 2014 said that like based on like brains of democrats versus republicans republicans are more likely to have like a gut reaction of something being a more disgusting at, at the same time though it's based on thought processing yeah. and that's interesting but, because you two like I, you're the baby democrat yeah. and then you were or at least your family's uh -huh. conservative before both nick and jazz were really disgusted and that's why like both of them were kind of that's definitely pseudoscience but it conforms my original suspicions that both of them are conservative so I'll take it, dude. I'm on my list. I thought Sai's question was really interesting. And what's so funny is I answered differently than what I was thinking in my head because I was thinking that if I saw a jar with a hand, I would be like, oh, there's a jar with it. It wouldn't really bother me. But I answered that it would because I thought that would be the answer they were looking for. And it turns out it totally was wrong. Typical Warren supporter. Oh my God, what a snake, dude. Okay, honestly. Honestly, he's probably a Warren supporter. He probably is. He does have that annoying uh, technocrat. Ugh, I shouldn't be saying this. He probably uh, half these dudes probably watch my shit if they're like Warren supporters. OK, I I'm sorry. He just gives me hella PMC vibes, dude. You know, I just I, it sucks, but he does. And dude, if you're if you're watching, I love you. You're, you're great. You, you do seem like a real Liz lad. Yeah, it's, it's the black girl to do that. <laughs> Oops for your top like two oh, candidates. What are the issues that like you most resonate PMC with? PMC means platform? professional managerial class, like upper level management I or mid-level management. I love the way she's run her campaign. Five. That it seems so- For the most so, part. For the most part. for the Native American. Yeah. Exactly, that is, oh my gosh. But she seems like she's really out to meet people personally and she spends hours waiting to take selfies and she calls people personally and she's only taking money from regular citizens, not big huge donors and I appreciate that so much. I felt like Nick didn't that was such a f cultivated ass, like totally bullshit move just so that these guys, these highly educated college whites could feel this way. Like, and it worked. And it f worked. She duped them. She duped all of you motherfuckers, dude. Holy shit. She's only taking money from regular citizens, not big, huge donors. And I... Wrong. <laughs> Wrong. Persist pack. Wrong. $14 million from a single donor. Wrong. Libs, dude. Appreciate that so much. I felt like Nick didn't come across as passionate. His answers just seemed a little premeditated. And I felt like they were just kind of read off without is the black girl. emotion behind them. The I really like he's... Warren, but I lean a little bit more towards Sanders because I was a sociology major. Mm. And so... Sociology? No, oh, okay. like <laughs> I'm a people person. And in order for everybody to succeed, we all need to build each other up, yeah. not tear each other down. And no. so Bernie, he's what very- What policies of Bernie? Are you like a- Well, his racial enough? justice is like a big thing for me, immigration, and then obviously like universal health care. And I'm not yeah. gonna lie, a lot of the stuff I get is from like black Twitter, so. <laughs> Which is like totally a that. It's her, she's <laughs> fake. <laughs>
America is a one party state anyway. I f called it. Why are we still playing this game? There is never a reason to play the game. What? It's you, isn't it? Oh my god. Hey guys, easy fucking claps. GG's literally undefeated. She said the first line that came out of her mouth was like, that's her. I don't like people telling me what to do. End the fucking game. Cut the fucking scene. Who is it? I know now. I'm my dog out of the I knew it. I <laughs> knew <laughs> all of you. Yeah. I knew oh it. Oh my god. You're lucky. You're lucky you're black. You you're lucky you're black. I fucking called it, bro. Hid behind our identity to portray herself as a Democrat. Uh, this dude also did it, but he, his drip was too good. Uh, that wasn't classic black Republican drip. She 100% hit behind our identity to be like, oh, I'm like, yeah, she's going to say she's a libertarian or some shit. Here was the line. I'm black and I hate when people tell me what to do. That's that's it. That's like black conservatism in a nutshell. You can sound racist all you want. Every single black person in this chat will agree with me on this. Every black Republican is only a Republican because they hate being told what to do. That's their, that's the only thing they say over and over again. You talk to any black, uh, you talk to any black conservative, you debate any black conservative, I've debated a lot of black conservatives, as you all know, from Larry Elder to uh, Gianno Caldwell, and it's always the same shit. You can't tell me what to do. And for those of you who are saying Christianity is a big reason, absolutely not. No, black, uh, black Democrats are still very Christian. Black Democrats are still some of the most conservative voters that we have, especially older black Democrats. Absolutely not. It's not, it has nothing to do with the Christianity, okay? It has everything to do with like going against the grain and hating that like, you know, you were told that you were a Democrat your entire life because you're black. And like, that's why you're, you're just, that they literally always say like, oh, well, you know, I'm, you know, you can't tell me what to do. That's why I'm a, I hate being typecast as a Democrat because I'm black said that his first reasoning for being a Democrat was because he's black. The way that I was thinking and coming at it was he would never assume that another black person would be a Republican, let alone want to be very friendly with him and joke around. I had my suspicions. I was like, I wouldn't be surprised if she was the mole, but in my head, I was like, I hope it's not Jocelyn who's the mole. It comes down to identities as a black person. For better, for worse, I think black people should stick together. It was just in here? Oh shoot, I feel bad, but like, I gotta pay off my student loan. I'm proud of myself, I'm gonna be honest. Sorry guys, but not really. The stereotype of Republicans is we're not white. We can be mixed race, we can be of someone that comes from an immigrant household like I did. I'm very Literally look! I, very <laughs> Call I do it. believe that. Oh, no, it's so I'm not dumb. choice. It's so stupid. Most stereotypes about what political party you're in are not true. We have an idea in this country of what each party is and you know what your interests are. Nick is gonna be a, a Republican in like four to five years. Like I can see Nick going down a rabbit hole and just becoming a Republican. He is too much of a Warren technocrat to, to actually be. Like he is too much of a r slash neoliberal. He is throwing me r slash neoliberal vibes all the way, dude. This is the guy in my Twitter replies like, I used to really like you, but it seems like nowadays you attack you know the Democratic Party no more than you attack Even Donald Trump. Signed, a concerned ex-fan. That's what he, that's what he seems like. Like he's just mad. 